Hey, welcome back Sea Family. I hope you guys are doing well and welcome for another episode of Kingdom Aquatica. I do apologize for the late upload of this video as I wasn't feeling good in the past week. But don't worry, I am doing great now. So let's get into it. From the last episode, I asked do you know this beautiful sea creature? If you say it's a puffer fish, then you are right. A puffer fish can inflate into a bowl shape to evade predators. Also known as bluefish. In Japan, they are called fugu and are very expensive delicious treat. They are prepared only by trained licensed fugu chefs. Most puffers are found in tropical and subtropical oceans of water, but some species live in brackish and even fresh water. The largest puffer fish is the tetraodon mbu puffer, while the smallest is the dwarf puffer fish. Here are 10 facts about the puffer fish. Number 1 Did you know the puffer fish is the most poisonous fish in the sea? The puffer is harmless unless eaten. The liver, the intestines, and the skin are highly poisonous and cause death in around 60% of people who eat it. If prepared properly, the puffer, or called fugu, is edible and considered a delicacy in Japan and Korea. The puffer's toxin, tetrodotoxin, is produced within the puffer's fish by bacteria. The fish acquire the bacteria by grazing on the reef and eating mollusk and other invertebrates. Weight for weight, tetrodotoxin is up to a hundred times as deadly as the venom of a black widow spider and over a thousand times more deadly than cyanide. It is one of the most poisonous natural substances. There is enough toxin in one puffer fish to kill 30 adult humans. And as of now, there is no known antidote for it. Number 2 Did you know puffer fish are masters of self-defense? They are not contented with being one of the most poisonous animals in the sea. But when they are threatened, they also inflate themselves with water, making themselves look much larger than they usually are. They do this by rapidly gulping water into their extending stomach. This makes them into a spiny ball three to four times their normal size. It's not good for the puffer fish though so they only do this when seriously threatened by other animals. Number 3 Hey sea family, did you know there are about 120 species of pufferfish? They are both living either on fresh or salt water. Number 4 Did you know pufferfish do not have any scales? but instead they have spines, which you may not be able to get a good look until they puff up. Because power fish don't have any scales, they are very sensitive to water variations and tend to be more at risk for diseases. As a fish owner, you have to be sure that the water quality is excellent, especially nitrate and ammonia levels in your tank. If these levels are high, it often indicates a dirty tank and can create health issues for your fish. Routinely, do water ch quality check to ensure the ideal health of your fish. Water checks can be done by fish stores for you on a monthly basis, or you can purchase a home kit to test your water if you're planning to keep a puffer fish as a pet in your aquarium. Number 5 Did you know a puffer fish's teeth never stop growing? Many fish species have teeth that stop growing at some point, but puffer fish do not. Puffer fish have four teeth, two at the top and two at the bottom. Both fuse to look like one large tooth, making puffer fish seems like they have beaks. They use their teeth for opening mussels, clams, and shellfish. Their teeth always keep on growing, so they need to feed on hard shells to help them organically trim their teeth and keep them short. Number 6 
Did you know there's a lot of predators in the sea that can eat the puffer fish? But sharks are the only species immune to the puffer fish toxin. They can eat puffer fish without any negative poison consequence affecting their body, making them one of the top predators of the food chain in the ocean. Number 7 Sea family, did you know the marine female puffer fish contains a high level of toxin in their ovaries and produces more tetrodotoxin before and during the season when they are developing and depositing eggs? When she lays the eggs, they all, she also releases some of the toxins and it sticks to the eggs and babies once they hatch. Tetrodotoxin is mainly found in the eggs and liver of a puffer fish. Number 8 Did you know pufferfish can be discreet or brightly colored? The body coloration is often related to the amount of toxin produced by the fish. The brighter the colors are, often associated with large quantity of toxin of the pufferfish. Number 9 Did you know a puffer fish are the only bony fish that can close their eyes? And now we know how they do it. They sink their eyeballs deep into their eye socket and then pucker the skin surrounding the eye together, like a camera lens closing. Number 10 Did you know more than 100 people die annually from pufferfish poisoning, almost all resulting from consuming the world's most deadly delicacy. Throughout history, thousands have met their demise from fugu poisoning, primarily in Japan, Korea, and China, where it is more readily found in sushi restaurants. The poison can kill you around 20 minutes to 24 hours. That wraps up this week's episode. See family, thank you so much for watching. Please comment below and let me know what do you think about this week's episode about the puffer fish. If you do like the video, please consider liking it and subscribing to the channel. Thank you so much, Sea Family, and I will see you in next week's episode of Kingdom Aquatica. For the next week episode of Kingdom Aquatica. Hey Sea Family, do you know what kind of fish this one is? If you do, comment down below. I'll even give you a hint, you can find this kind of fish in pet stores.